Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. I just want to do a quick technical video on the SPY. Here is the daily chart and it looks like the uptrend is pretty strong. Right now all of the moving averages are heading upwards and we are basically in this channel. And what's probably not a coincidence is the angle of this upward blue channel matches the angle of the previous uptrend that we had earlier in the year before the April correction. So that channel looks something like this. And now we have uh, this channel here. So what's most likely going to happen is over the next several weeks, because this uptrend is so strong and it hasn't been broken yet, we'll likely continue to see the market going up. Now previously, what caused the market to fall out of the channel was this big down day here, this red bar, followed by a back test, which hit the bottom of this channel and then it got rejected off of that. And once it fell below the 9 EMA, the green line, and the blue line, the 21 EMA, selling pressure took over and the market headed lower. So right now we're still in this uptrend, but that doesn't mean that over the next few days we won't get a correction because right now we are at the top of this channel. So we could see a reversal over the next few days, which will take prices back down to this 551 level. But even then, this uptrend is still in play and there's no reason to get bearish until we see something like this where the market breaks out of the channel. But I wouldn't be super bullish because I don't think it's very likely the market will be so strong it'll pop out of the channel. That doesn't mean it won't, but that hasn't happened yet. And in the previous uptrend, which lasted for many months as well, that did not happen either where the market went above the upward trend. So a potential trade that I could do is to go two weeks out, which will be the 26th, and sell a call spread that is still within this channel. So on July 26th would be this gray line over here, and we can see that at this date, if the SPY continues to go upwards and stays within this channel, then it shouldn't go over 572. So this is a simple $1 spread, and I have four quantities. Order partially filled. Order filled. So that filled at 18 cents. The idea is to hold this position as long as the SPY doesn't close any days above the top of this blue channel. But if it goes over, then I will scale out of my position. And of course, if it goes down, I will just keep the position. And hopefully in a couple of weeks, the option spread will expire worthless. So that's it for now. We'll see how it goes and I'll give you an update later on. Thanks a lot for watching. Good luck with your investments and until next time.